Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make these 3D foam sticks. And I hesitate to call these stickers because these aren't like stickers that you cut out and stuff. These are mandatory. Well, they're not mandatory, but they look really cool with stickers and they make them have a really nice pop and 3D to them. And um, I have a tutorial coming up where um, I will show you how to make a sticker that requires a lot of these. So yeah, and um, instead of using those, because I know you can't get those everywhere, um, I used foam and um, double-sided tape, and I know foam isn't exactly a thing you would always have in your house. Maybe it is if you're a really crafty person, but um, I went out and bought this at Walmart. It was pretty cheap. There was like a ton in the package, and I'm just using the white one because I like the white. And um, so hopefully you can find those where you are. And this is what it looks like. It's just in this big sheet. Um, so yeah, let, now let's get started. Okay, so the things you will need are some double-sided tape, some foam, and some scissors. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is take our double-sided tape. And um, we're just going to take a strip of it. And you can choose to do it this way or this way, but I'm just doing it this way. And I'm just going to line it up with my foam relatively straight. And I'm just going to try to lay it on my foam as um, straight and aligned as possible. So you might want to like stretch it out first and then just place it on all at once. That I find is the easiest um, way to do this, but you can do it whatever way you want. Um, yeah, so now we're going to take our scissors and just snip off our double-sided tape just around where the foam is. So you should get something like this, and now we're done with our double-sided tape. So we're just going to take our scissors and come here on the back and just snip off any excess double-sided tape that was left on the edges. So I've done that side and I'm just going to fold this up and I'm done with this. And now I'm going to do the other side and just repeat the same process. Just like that. And now you can choose to leave it just like this or you can cut this out. I'm just going to leave it like this so I can keep using this piece of foam for other, um, other foam sticks. And now we're going to flip to the other side and do the exact same thing. So we're just going to take our double-sided tape and just stretch it out and just lay it flat onto our foam. And again, snip it off. And now we're just going to, again, take our scissors and snip off any excess we have left. Just like that. So, yeah, now we're done. Okay, so I decided to cut it into a strip so it would be easier whenever I needed to use it. I would just snip off a bit. So yeah, there you have your finished foam stick, and I'm just going to um, teach you guys how to use this. So if you've seen my balloon sticker tutorial, I use like these puffy foam things, and I don't have them with me right now. So um, if you haven't checked out that video, be sure to go um, watch it. And um, so basically these are like slightly 3D and you can put them on the bottom of stickers to make them look more three-dimensional. And I have a tutorial coming up, which I said in the beginning, where we will be using a ton of these. So I know those aren't available everywhere. So yeah, this is how to make your own. And basically, whenever you need to use it, you just take your scissors and snip off however much you however much you need. Um, so yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!